This is my tutorial on how to make uh, a cup look like glass. We shall first make our glass. This we do by using our default cube. I shall just uh, maximize the tree view window so we can see a little more. If we go to front view by pressing 1 on your numerical keyboard, front, you can see that we are in a front mode here pair. Then we go to edit mode by pressing tab or go where it stands object mode and choose edit mode. Then deselect all the vertices by pressing A button. And then select the topmost uh, uh, vertices. Maybe pressing B for box select. Oops, wrong button. B it was. And dragging a marking line on the topmost vertices and release your mouse. Then rotate around your object. Ob ob object or cube in this case so we can see a little bit from above. Then we press uh, E for extrude and choose region and press escape to cancel any movement. Then press S key for scale and scale it down a bit. Press me Looks like that. Then extrude again and move it in a Z up and down. And then go to front view again and the, so you can see how far down it is. And now the editing is completed. Now we shall make make the this cube like look like a cube with, excuse me, glass cup. So we go back into edit mode by pressing tab and then we in the bottom window we locate this button and find modifiers then we add a modifier by pressing add modifier and then we choose uh, where is it? Subsurf. There it was, it was hidden. You couldn't see it. But it will be in this data list. Alright. Change the levels to two. Also, go over to uh, Link and Materials and press Set Smooth. Now we shall take a look at our former cube. Now we have uh, something that looks like a cup. Now we shall change the materials so it looks like glass. Dude needs to go by going to our material buttons. That's located there. We go to mirror transparency. Enabling both ray mirror and ray transparency. We change ray mirror from 0 0.00, .00 to about uh, 2030 or somewhere around that. And we also change IOR to uh, 40 proximity. We cannot take 40 to do that. Now go to it is materials here where you normally set the color and look at this ace value and draw that 
all the way down to zero. And then we go and check our preview window. As we can see, it has been transpa almost transparent. Before I render this, I'm going to add a plane under the cup we just made by going into oops by pressing space add in hello oh, excuse me in object mode add space bar add mesh plane and then recess it so it's a little bit bigger and a cap can go to back to object mode, go to front view, and drag it down a bit so we have the cap uh, hovering above it. And here we have it. We can make it a little bit bigger, you can see now. Put me like that. And there it is. I'm going to check what the camera sees. Ah, that is pretty good. And now I'm going to render it to see how it looks like. And it will look like something like this. Notice that you can change the, all the values so you can get another result. I hope you have use of this and I will maybe make another tutorial on how to animate with this. Like a water simulation with this. Have fun.